Hey everybody, it's Al with Bobcat. So today I wanted to talk about changing your machine setup location or your origin after you've already programmed the job. So you can see in this example I have a profile routine and then I also have this open pocket routine. Now if I click on my machine setup, the gnomon will come up and you can see that I have my part uh, zero on the center of the part. Now. I've already computed my toolpath, and if I want to change my zero position, I can do so. I just go back to my machine setup, I choose edit, I go to origin, and then I can pick any location that I want. In this case, I'm going to pick this back location, and then I'll choose OK. Now, I've changed the origin, but at this time, the toolpath hasn't come along with it. Okay. So what you need to do is reselect your geometry, and I have uh, my geometry on different layers here, so I'll reselect. Um, in this case, when I did this profile here, uh, I need to modify my uh, start positions again because I've reselected. So I need to update that feature there. And then I also need to update uh, this feature here. So we'll reselect. All right. And then from there, I can compute and compute. And then now I've updated it. It looks like I haven't gotten this one yet. So let's try that again. We'll reselect spacebar and compute. Hmm. Let's remove them. Reselect and compute. All right, and compute. All right, there we go. So uh, in that case, I removed and reselected. But when you change your zero position, you have to update your tool paths because your tool paths are based off of that zero position. Uh, usually you can just go in and reselect, recompute. If you reselect, um, in this case, we had defined specific uh, start positions and directions. So we needed to update those as well. Uh, with the open pocket here, we, ne we needed to remove and reselect, and then we were able to move our tool paths uh, to match our new origin. Okay, so if you change your origin, just edit your machine setup, and then from there, reselect and recompute your tool path features, and then they're updated for the new zero position. If there's any questions about this uh, or other topics, you can always reply back to the Facebook, the YouTube, or whatever thread this video may be posted in. Otherwise, we'll see you in the next one. Thank you so much.